Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel and today we're gonna be fixing a windshield wiper cowl on my 03 Mustang GT. I'm gonna show you what happened to mine. It's in better days. It's all cracked up, dried up, rotted up, as you can see. So we're gonna be replacing this bad boy. And here is the piece that I got. I got this off of walmart.com and I paid $71 with free shipping, which is like one piece. I would suggest staying away from uh, eBay ones, the two pieces. I have it on my other Mustang and that thing is total garbage, but neither is this thing perfect. But what I do like about it, it is one piece. So I'm gonna show you what's wrong with it. And here we go. And this is a Dorman brand and you can see the double sided sticky tape is just coming off along with the rubber so it's total garbage so what you need to do is you need to get yourself a nice 3M adhesive tape and replace it. Hopefully with this one it will stay on for about like 5-6 years without any problem because I know 3M is a really good brand. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to replace this cheap double sided sticky tape with this rubber along here. And then we're gonna go install it on this car. All right, definitely use 3M products because look at this. This thing is nice and firm on there, unlike before where everything was coming off. So this is gonna last for a very long time, especially in this. I'm not gonna have to worry about any of that stuff. All right, so next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna remove this one and put a new one on. And to remove the wipers, which is really easy, you just pull on this bad boy. This one up right here and I just pull it off. Two hands. There you go. And same thing on this guy right over here. Pull this. Alright, so what you want to do is you want to remove this gasket. And right underneath you're gonna find three screws. And then should be able to pick pick up and slide off. And then you gotta disconnect a spray nozzles. All right, while I have this halfway off, I just wanna show you how it looks underneath. There is gonna be a couple of clips that go in here. And then obviously you have the water hose that you need to be replaced and then disconnect it as well. All right, here's a better view of a broken piece outside of a car. As you can see, it's pretty much dry rotted. So I got everything off of it that I kind of need. As you can see, this is like we, um, rubber and it's is really good so with the 3m it's as good if not better so i got my uh, water hose replaced and don't be like me be careful when you pull it out because it is very dry and brittle so i had to fix mine on three different points right here because they kind of snap so what i did is i used the rubber hose and slid slid this plastic hose inside this rubber hose so this should be good and i can turn this whichever way it needs to be so now we're just going to put it back on the car and see the difference
All right, here's a better view, better look. The fitment on it is really good, as you can see. It concaves very well. The quality of it, it's also like OEM. I'm gonna show you the other side. Fits really well, it fits like a glove, honestly. As you can see, nice and smooth, concaves, seals to the window. So the only flaw was a double-sided sticky tape. But you know, if you just get a 3M double-sided tape, uh, you're golden. Just get this thing for $71 and $5 of a tape, 76 plus taxes, whatever. So around like 80 bucks, 80, 80 some dollars. And you got yourself nice, good quality, almost like OEM part for 71 bucks. I really like it. Came out really good. Looks really good. Changes the car a lot. With that being said, I appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button because I'm going to have a lot more videos on this car, especially with my old Mustang. I'm going to be changing the video, shocks, body kit, exhaust, possibly side exhaust, my most hated video. But yeah, stay tuned. Appreciate you guys and thank you.